Okay, so good afternoon again, everyone. Um, so uh, this is going to be the q and this session. So if you have uh, any challenge while we're working on the project or uh, if there is no challenge, uh, maybe you can share your progress with the others just to help us know where you stand. And yeah, if you have any challenge, we are here to help. So the floor is yours. Okay, I think it's better if I call out names, I guess. Um, so let's start from the uh, ground up. So let's go with Zarufail. Now, Zarufail, would you mind opening your mic and uh, telling us if you have any challenge or if you don't have any cha challenge, uh, maybe just share your progress. I'm working on me. I preached that one that I did. I'm working on task three. Uh, I don't know if I don't know if it's just me, uh, but I'm having a hard time uh, hearing you. Uh, can you speak a bit lo louder? Oh, sorry, uh, give me a minute. Okay, okay. Uh, in the meantime, maybe, uh, yeah, Yeshi, uh, can you go? Can you just open your mic and tell us if you have any challenge or uh, if you don't have any challenge, uh, maybe share your progress so, so, so far. <clears throat> Uh, okay, uh, we do appreciate it if you guys could talk so that we can have a discussion. But if we're not able to talk, maybe I just type uh, your responses on the comment box on the message. Uh, oops. Um, okay, Injala, uh, can you go? And ne next to Injala, uh, Tahir, and then Leah. So, uh, Jada, you can open your mic and speak. Okay, uh, that's good to hear. Tahir, can you go next? Okay, I'll come back. Okay, uh, bank, sorry, file. Can you hear me? Yes, yes. Okay, thank you. Uh, I'm working on task three and everything's going well. However, I encountered an issue. There are, I think there are uh, many CVs listed on the challenge documents. And, uh, 
uh, we need to select pi for each of the team. Can I write? Um, yeah, so, uh, so in the folder, in the we, CD folder. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Should we list uh, their ID numbers or uh, use their, or can we create the name for each of the selected uh, CV list? Okay, um, so, uh, so for instance, you have a folder containing uh, CVs for the finance, right? In the finance folder, yeah. there are uh, some CVs uh, under that. So, what you can do is you can just select five at random, and take notes from of those. And um, you can either, uh, when you are submitting them, uh, will you require you to submit a folder, right? Hello. Yeah, but yeah. what my question is: uh, mm -hmm. the listed CVs are only by ID number. Yes. I think there are; they have no name. Yeah, so the name is found inside. Name? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. No, uh, no, I didn't answer. Like I was saying, uh, like the name of the applicant is found inside, right? Okay. Hello. Yeah, yeah, I'm here. Okay, so the for the name of the applicant is found inside, inside the folder, inside the file, right? For instance, if you look at uh, like let, let's say um, applicant number thousand and uh, something. You can find um, the, their names inside, and if you were available on the on yesterday's session, you can ask the LLM to um, rank the applicants based on uh, their name or the file name. Okay, okay. but uh, I can't get the name on. I get only ID number. I will search. It. Thank you. Uh, okay, that's good. Uh, okay, uh, so anyone else? Uh, Leah, can you speak? Um, um, so basically, um, so far so good. I've been able to tackle task one successfully and two as well. I haven't had any issues really. So now I'm headed into task three, where I pick the candidates, and then you, um, with the assistance of AI, I am able to screen them for the different positions. Um, I do understand we need to put this data in. I don't know if we're putting it in the Google Doc or if we're putting it in table format. The um, because I can see at the end of task four it says use tables to keep track of the information. So at the very end, do I need a Google Doc or a table? of some sort. Hello? Sorry, uh, I didn't know I was muted. So the reason that um, you are asked to uh, have a table is just to help you uh, with uh, keeping track of each candidate's uh, points, right? The key points. Yeah. So, uh, it's easier, it's way much easier for you to compare uh, when you put the key, uh, like the key points in a table. So that's why you need to have a table. So for okay. task four, yeah. Okay, thank you. Oh, okay. Did I answer, did I answer your quick question? Uh, Yes, 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 you did. Oh. Thank you. Okay, okay, that's good. Okay, I think everyone has spoken. Uh, Kiromsa? Um, can you speak? Can you share if you have, uh, if you have had any challenge while work working on the uh, project or? If you don't have any ch challenge, uh, maybe just share your progress so, so far. 
okay thank you uh, i'm doing also the task uh, already i have finished the second task and uh, i'm doing the third one so till now i'm not having any challenge so thank you okay thank you for sharing uh, yeah so if there is no more question maybe we can end it here Okay, we'll just stop the recording. So, no more questions, right? Okay, Tahir. Yes, Tahir. I hear you can speak. I think. Oh. Okay. For task four, how can you make the interview? Yeah. So you're gonna uh, make the screening is going to be for um, just for the selection process uh, of the screening, the screening, and uh, for the interview, you're just gonna include the question only because you're not going to co conduct any question but um, if you want no no yeah i think uh, the, this is enough because um it's going to be more complex uh, trying to come up with the answer for each candidate so yeah so write just the questions for each uh, department for each candidate and the summary of the screening Did I answer your question? Okay, good. So any more quick questions, oh, guys? Okay. Okay, is everything clear? Can I get some emojis?